adventure and we went to a cotton gin little house and we were just walking around and uh, he was explaining like all the different cool stuff. So this is the bush that all the cotton grew on and this is literally has so much thorns on it. You, when you gra go and grab it, you would literally be pricking yourself all the day long. Ow. This is like 500 pounds of cotton, so that could lift it up. Then over here is seeds when you pick it up, it's pretty hard, so the, the younger people and the adults would go and they would pick the cotton, and then the elderly would stay in and they would pick the seeds from the cotton, which I actually tried picking the seeds from the cotton and it's pretty hard. It's actually pretty difficult to get all the cotton off of the seed. So that I would be, I can't imagine doing this all day. That's like the best I can get. I can't really get the cotton off that I've tried. So this is all the cotton when it's been refined and it's been separated from the seeds. It's nice and soft. And also, when you, when they would go out in the field, they would have like this little sack. This was, this is what the um, women would wear. This is what the women would wear. They would go over like this. And then they would walk in the fields and go and pick the cotton and put it back in. And And there's also some bugs that were like doing stuff and they are like kind of like not good to like the population of like cotton or something. This was the first ever machine had to kill the um, all the bugs that were like messing with all the plants and all that. So th they would like lift this up and then they would move this. And Glass the... and water mixed together to create a sticky substance makes it weight down to the brushes. Once the sticky substance is on the plant, it catches the pesky insects. Eli Whitney made an invention called the cotton gin and he wanted it he used it to um he wanted it to abolish slavery, but it did the opposite. It like made slavery even worse. And also it was used to like separate the seeds from the cotton. And all that. This machine would separate the plane and the cotton so that people wouldn't get poked by the stick. This is how they separated. This this one would go through and that one would rotate and it would just like pick out all the sticks. So yeah. I hope you guys like this little uh, cotton gym little video and if you guys make sure to smash the like button uh, like and hit the notification button and comment and guys this is about the end of end of this video and guys i'll see you all in the next video bye